What's up guys? In this video, I'm going to very quickly show you how to set up automated responses on Facebook. Now, if you're an administrator or a manager of a page, um, and in this case, I'm using a restaurant page that I manage, then on the left side, you're going to see this sort of toolbar here that has all of the different options for your page that you can set up. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to go down to settings and then messaging. And then right here on this section right here, you're going to see where you can go to automated responses or if you scroll right to the bottom, you'll see where it says set up automated responses and we can just click set up. Now in this case, I know that on this restaurant page, there's a number of questions that customers frequently ask. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to the frequently asked questions and I'm gonna turn that on. And for the purpose of this video, I've got some pre-written uh, questions and their answers. Now there is a limit to how long answers can be. So some of these answers that I have here uh, they may not fit, so I might have to modify them. So we'll take a look at that in a second. So that's one thing to keep in mind, by the way. So now I'm going to go down. And now that I've turned on frequently asked questions, I'm also going to click here and I'm going to go to edit message and I'm going to add a question here. Now, the first question that I want to include is where are you located? This is something that people often ask. And like I said before, I've already got the answer pre-written, so I'm going to paste that in. Now, one thing you'll notice is that I left a blank here right next to the word hi. And that's because you can add your customer's name. So what I'm going to do is hi, first name of recipient. And in this case, obviously it's showing my name. So hi, Herschel, we are open to the public, da, 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 da. And then it shows the information about the location. Now, the other thing you can do is add a button. So right here, we can take this link and we can add a button that says get directions and just add the link. And that's a link that actually goes directly to Google Maps and shows the location right there of the restaurant. So the next thing we can do is add question. Now to add my second question, can I see your menu? And of course, I've got the answer pre-written like before. I'm going to go ahead and add the customer's name. Now, the other thing that I did here, by the way, is not only did I answer the question, but I remind the customer, potential customer, where our menu is. And I tell them, you know, not to forget to join our border rewards. So it's like a rewards program. And of course, um, you also want to have the phone number probably on some of these answers here. It's also a good idea to add the phone number. So I'm going to put that underneath the location. And now we can add our third question. What everybody wants to know, when is happy hour? And again, add the customer's first name. And that's pretty much all I have space for. As you can see, I only have 16 characters left, so I can't really include any more information. And then the last question I'm going to add here, right down here, do you have specials? Okay, there you go. I fit in as many as I could. And then basically I can add a button uh, for more information and add a link to the website. And then I'm gonna hit save. Now the other automated responses that you can put in where it will sort of use, Facebook will use AI to recognize what the person is saying to you and then it'll respond accordingly are related to location. So I'm gonna activate that one, click on it. I will add the location information. It was basically the same answer as I put on the other one. Map link, there we go, and hit save on that. And then we can go to hours and open that as well. And it looks like it's already got something in there as well, but I'm gonna go ahead and add the whole thing. Of course, add the customer's name again, and that's it. And then we have a more information button that leads to the website. So basically I've got those as automated responses and the FAQs. So now that's all saved, we're gonna go back to the page and then I'm gonna view it as myself. And that way I can send a message. And now I've previously interacted with my own page. I know that sounds sad, but um, basically in order to see your options, you can just click this little menu here and you'll see where are you located? Can I see your menu? When is happy hour? Do you have specials? So if I hit, do you have specials? There you go. I get a response with all the daily specials that I had set up and a more information button. When is happy hour? Boom, get a response right away. Can I see your menu? Boom, there it is. And where are you located? And that message comes in. So there you guys have it. Um, as you see, everything is working as it should. And that's uh, how you do it. Now, on a personal note, yes, I've been on a very long hiatus and I'm sorry about that, but I am here and I'm always available. So if you guys have any questions, 
please ask them in the comment section below. And if you have any questions or concerns, same. And if you found this video helpful, please don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, and ring the bell for notifications. Thanks for watching, guys. Thank you.